Hey everybody, welcome back. It's time for some new exciting products from Olight for their August sale. So, let's check them out. Alright folks, welcome back. So this sale is going to run today, August 11th. All the way to August 12th at midnight Eastern Standard Time, Eastern Daylight Time, I'm sorry. And it's up to 40% off on specific products. Some of the bundles you can add $1 and get a uh, mini Oticol Olive Green or you can get an O Pen Mini. There's a ton of bundles, so definitely check it out. If you do find something that's not on sale and you want it, you can still use my discount code, which is Iridium242, and get the discount on it. So, First, let's start off this video with a look at a brand new innovative light. This is the Arkfeld flat flashlight with a green laser and a white light right here. Take a quick look at it from all angles. Very, very interesting light. Probably going to become my new everyday carry light. Um, I can't think of a reason I need a green laser. But for those of you working maybe on a, in an industrial setting where you need to point something out, you've just flipped that over. You have your choice of light or laser. Push down on the button, and you've got a laser. Nice green laser. We're going to test that out outside a bit. And if you don't want that, you flip it to the other side and hit the light. Now I have it on low here. But basically push and hold, and it will get progressively lighter. And of course, if you push twice, you get turbo. You push three times, you get the strobe. So that's how it works. Very, very nice, very clean design. Uh, you do have the little bar there that will show you how much power you have left in the light itself. Very, very nice. Really like it. The dimensions on it are really, really slim. Uh, some people were complaining about the bottom, putting the charger, the magnetic charging instead of USB-C to make it thinner. Personally, I think it kind of contours out nicely. And with the clip here, that will give it kind of a ledge to sit in your pocket and not push the clip out more. It kind of just will fit into your pocket very easily. Very nice pocket clip. So this is definitely going to become my new everyday carry light. Now, a little bit on it. You have two color temperatures if you want to choose from cool white and neutral white. I believe, I'm going to look here and see, this is cool white on mine. And neutral white is that very, very bright light, okay? So with the flip of a switch, you can go from green laser to light, however you need it. It's compact and very, very powerful. The thickness is basically half an inch, 0 0.59, okay? And 4.33 inches long you can carry in your pocket. you got five brightness levels and a max output of 1,000 lumens. And honestly, for an everyday carry flashlight, that's pretty good for me. It does have a memory mode on it, so let's see here. Last was in the low. Bring it up one more. Take it to its highest level without going into turbo. I'll turn it off, and it stays in that mode. So whatever mode you leave it in, it will stay in. I do like that fact. Uh, you do have a nice magnetic end again. Like we said, it is magnetic, and it will. that's titanium, so it won't stick. But you see it is magnetic. We'll get into these tools in a second here. Um, I'm just going to start having to call them O-Tool because I've got some cool tools as well as O-Lights. <laughs> so you do have the magnetic thing on the end there. It allows you to pretty much put it up anywhere. It's IPX7 rated. You have multiple colors to choose from on this one. You've got the black. You can get it in this desert tan, kind of similar to this light. And an OD green, kind of similar to that. And a blue. Okay, so you have multiple different colors to choose from. Your beam distance goes out about 331 feet. Max performance, again, is 1,000 lumens. MCC3 magnetic charging. It's got a built-in 1,050 milliamp hour lithium polymer battery. Okay, the levels on it. All right, it will go from 1,000 lumens for about four minutes down to 300 lumens for 110 minutes. Okay, so it does cool down after four minutes, but 1,000 lumens for four minutes is pretty darn good. Level two is 300. That will run for 34 minutes. Level three is 60 lumens. That will run for 11 hours. Okay, and level four, which is 15 lumens, will run for 41 hours. And level 5, which is the lowest one we started it out on, is 8 days. And as you can see, it does have a stroke. So let's take it outside and take a look at it. All right, so let's start out with it on the low. Now, I'm sure you can't see that anywhere but right in the front there. Let's move it up one to the next level. There we go. Getting a little brighter. There we go. And let's take it all the way up. And there you go. So you can see how bright that is. Take it all the way to the turbo, 1,000 lumens. It does light up very nice in the immediate area. You know, this isn't a thrower, but it's not meant to be. It's meant to just light up your area really, really wide. You see a nice, big, wide, open area of light around here in my driveway. All right. 
Let's take it over to my garden real quick, my yard I mean. You can see how nicely that looks up in the trees. So it definitely does the job. Uh, very pleased with it. Let's try out the laser as I move the camera back here. We're going to flip it over to the laser. And there's the dot. Let's see how far the dot goes. I don't want to get anybody in trouble here. That's a good, I'd say 100 yards out there. Yeah, that's way, way out there. That's pretty darn impressive. Um, don't know if I'd use this for any kind of other thing other than just pointing stuff out in a business setting or something, but it's definitely bright. It definitely works very well. So let's go look at that one more time here. We'll go back to the uh, highest level. And there you go. So you can kind of see everything. And again, I'll take you over this way to the, to the yard. Okay. So you can see up. I go up my tree there. You can see up into the clouds and everything. That's really, really bright. All right, let's get it back on the table and move on to the next bunch of items that I think are really cool from Olight. All right, so that was pretty impressive. Now, remember, on sale, just the Arkfeld light. It was $89.99. It's on sale now for $67.49. And there are bundles galore with that knife, that, that light, so check them out. Don't worry about it. There's different types of bundles if you're interested. I just want to showcase the light to you and let you know that's a really cool little flashlight. And I am definitely going to be testing this out and carrying this around with me every day and see just how I like it. All right, let's move on to the next item, okay? And this is the Oticle EDC Utility Knife. Now, these were $16.95. For $15.26, $15.26, you're going to be getting yourselves one of these. Five-in-one tool can serve as a bottle opener on the bottom there, mini pry bar on the corner, okay? Uh, definitely a nice little 6 point, uh, what is it, 6.35, yeah, millimeter hex wrench if you need it. Um, I've yet to use a hex wrench on any of these tools, honestly, but you never know. It's always, always the first time. Uh, but that's not really its job. Its job is to be a utility knife. And that's the coolest thing about this, because it just uses regular straight razors, like that. Now, to change out the razor, once you go through it and use it up, you're going to unscrew that, take this piece out, and that razor will come right out, and you'll put a new one in. Very, very easy to use, um, kind of like the knife that never gets dull. Got to love it. It does have the nice G10 green scales on it. Very, very nice, kind of like smooths right into your hand. Now, if you have a job that requires you to open a lot of boxes... And it's funny, I'm going to tell you a very quick story here because I don't want the video to be too long. Um, I used to work in a hotel in banquets. And I swear, you know, we served the food, prepped the food, all that. But I swear our main job was breaking down boxes after we did banquets. So I went through so many gas station junk knives in that job. That was the first time I ever really carried a knife. And I went through so many junk knives through that job, you know. Had I bought a good one, I probably would have ruined it because I didn't know how to sharpen it. So let me tell you something. Something like this, really, really handy for a utility-type knife where you're always cutting open boxes. I'm going to try it out. i got a box over here. I'm going to move everything out of the way here, and we're going to try it out and see how we like it. Now, if you've ever done this, you know that tape and cardboard are the enemies of a sharp knife. I swear, they, they just kill it instantly. That's really, really nice. I'm able to cut that open. Put that right through there. Right through there. Very, very easy to use. And there you go. Nice and flat ready for anything. So, definitely does the job it's supposed to do. Um, that's a small example, of course, but having these little sharp edges like that, I really, really like that. And this is definitely going to be something that I would actually keep with me, carry, and use. Uh, I'd probably stick a lanyard through there, since it doesn't have a clip for your pocket. I'd just stick a lanyard in there so I could pull it out of my pocket with the lanyard whenever I need it. But definitely a sweet little utility knife. And for 15 bucks, you really can't go wrong. I've seen these, they're so expensive compared to what this is, and uh, they really don't do anything all that different. So, definitely a cool little thing. That is the Otical EDC Utility Knife. Very interchangeable. Whenever the blade goes dull, you just pop in a new one. Very easy to use. So, the weight on it is about 1.93 ounces. It is spring-loaded with the button design there, so it does lock into place, you know, wherever you need it, it'll lock into place there. It measures 3.38 inches by 1.29 inches. And it is a very, very durable and sturdy little tool, all in all. I won't say knife because, well, it's sort of a knife, but it's sort of as a, a utility knife, a box cutter type knife. Definitely cool. Let's move on to another item that I really thought I'd never own. And I kind of doubted the utility of something like this in such a small size. But I ran into a situation where I actually wished I had it. And that is the Otical 2 gray versatile tool. That is this guy here, okay? 
it has everything you could possibly want and all the different you know the 16 millimeter hex the little pocket clip there um, it does have a bottle opener you know it's really funny I've yet to open a bottle with a bottle opener I've never used a tool to open a bottle <laughs> you know I mean maybe because I don't drink a lot of beer in bottles but I've never used a tool like that and it does have the infamous pry bar now my thing always was why the heck do I need a pry bar for and if I need one I'm gonna need one a whole lot bigger than this and then the other day I was doing something um, trying to get something open and I thought to myself, eh, just use your knife. And then the, the little voice in your head was like, use your knife? What are you, crazy? You'll ruin the edge. <laughs> so these are handy to have. If you work in a job where you're constantly prying things open, uh, if you find you run into that situation often with other things in life, these are definitely handy to have. You have all the wrenches here. You have the bottle opener again. Very, very strong um, little pocket clip there. That is not going to come out accidentally. That is in there really, really good. And you do have a little bit of a brass accent along here. Definitely grips in your hand well. You can get under things. Uh, again, sure beats using a knife, running your knife edge. Um, I've seen, I, I belong to a lot of the EDC groups, you know, everyday carry groups on uh, Facebook. And I'm amazed at how many people carry a pry bar, you know, a small little pry tool like that. And I always thought, what on earth are you going to be prying that you need a tool for it every day? Well, honestly, it might be something I throw in an everyday carry bag. I don't know, I'd stick it in my pocket. But let me tell you something, when you need it, you need it, and you don't want to mess up your tool, your knife, and mess it up. So, these were originally $39.95. 40 bucks, I probably wouldn't pay 40 bucks for one, but they're on sale for $31. It's an 8-in-1 tool, serves as a pry bar, bottle opener, metric ruler. There is a metric ruler on here, but I forget where. I think it's this, this, these little measurements. See, oh, yeah, the measurements along the side there. Okay, nope, wrong side. There we go. So there is a metric ruler if you need it in millimeters, okay? Along that is 5 millimeters, 6 millimeters, 6.35, 8, and 10 millimeters, okay? Made of excellent materials. It's a titanium with a high strength and corrosion resistance. You do have this little bit of copper here. You can kind of patina that however you want, or just let it naturally patina as you carry and use it, all right? It does have a nice eye-catching look to it. You know, i got to say, it's stonewashed body, the copper accents, the glossy blue hardware, if you're into carrying stuff that looks nice, you know, and I, I don't want to carry junk. I, don't, I like stuff that looks nice, you know, so I'm pretty much uh, digging it. I definitely think I will be carrying that maybe in my uh, EDC bag, my little hip bag or something. Um, I wouldn't see myself putting it in my pocket unless I knew I was going somewhere where I'm going to be prying stuff open all day long. Then I'd carry it, but, you know, I'd probably put it in my everyday carry bag. It's easy to, uh, to carry that way. So... You, really easy to carry. You do have that pocket clip, secures into your pocket very, very well. You can put it on a backpack, whatever, okay? The inlay is copper. The pocket clip is titanium. The body material is titanium as well. This is very, very lightweight for what it is, okay? 1.76 ounces or 50 grams. The thickness is 0.37 inches, okay? Your length on it, 4.52 inches, and your width is 0.87 inches, so it's almost a full inch across. Definitely nice little knife. Now, the last thing they have here, and I'm actually carrying one of these on my keychain in titanium, is the IXV Desert Tan Flashlight. Now, there are bundles for all this stuff, okay? This is one of the things that will either come in a bundle or you can buy it individually. They were $21.95, okay? They're $19.76. Now, you have that nice little turn on a little for, little for low, a little for more for high. So, you got that low there, okay? turn on. I mean turn to the left <laughs> and a little bit more and you get high. 180 lumens on high. What is the lumens on low? I think four lumens on low. Very, very nice little handy little uh, light. I have used mine on my keychain so many times since I put it on there. Uh, I did have another Olight on there. I forget the, the, uh, the designation on it. But these do USB-C charge. So you basically unscrew them put it in there, and they do have a little bit of lubricant in there, you know, so it sticks together. They have a built-in 130 amp milliamp hour lithium-ion battery. It'll run the light up to 12 hours on low, so if you're going to put it on that low level, it'll run for 12 hours. You can see it's actually a pretty bright little light, and I mean, for a keychain light, normally in the dark, that's more than enough. So if you need more than that, one of the things I like about this is it's not going to fall off. The first O-light I had unscrewed itself and just popped off and fell off and I was sitting there with this end of it here and no battery somewhere in my gym it disappeared I don't know where it went so with this you always have that retainer on there 
and it's easy to keep off. It won't accidentally activate in your pocket. You just unscrew it so that point is right there and then it won't turn itself on unless you actually affirmatively move the switch like that. So I like the feature. It's definitely a handy little light. They even have a little diagram on the back for off, low, and high. If you don't know how to do that, it does come with a little attachment for your key ring. Definitely a nice little light and uh, very inexpensive. So what I'm liking about this is it's all new stuff almost. Other than that, this stuff is fairly new. I have not seen it. And this flashlight is brand new. And I'll tell you something. I really like the looks of it. It's a little bit modern. I don't know how, you know, maybe... I'm, I'm kind of thinking about if I use it in a tactical scenario with a firearm. You know, I'd have to turn on the light like this and hold it like that. But honestly, it's no problem to hold it like that. I can't move my hand all the way up because I'll hit the camera. But it would be no problem to hold it like that. Uh, the levels are simple enough to go through. you got your low, medium, and high. And if you want turbo again, you push twice and you get your turbo. So, And also, too, the interesting thing when you switch this, it will switch the laser on. If it's on, it's on, no matter what. You have to turn it off with the middle button. So that's definitely handy. Um, having a laser on this would be awesome, say, for if you work in a warehouse and you want to tell people where something needs to be moved. Um, I always think of this stuff as work-related, you know, uh, because that's why I started carrying a flashlight and a knife for my jobs. And uh, I, I always tend to think of it as work-related stuff. However, at the tactical thing end of things, it would definitely fit in your hand well enough where you could use that in a firearm for lighting or whatever. So definitely cool stuff. Now, there's multiple bundles on here, okay? So check out the site at the link in the description below. There's some really good deal on everything. And again, if you find a light that you've always wanted, all right, but you, it isn't on sale in this sale. You can use my code Iridium242 to save on that light. I believe the only thing you can't is the was X9R, the really big, huge flashlight. That's the only thing you can't use that code on. But anything that's not on sale on the website, you can use that code on. Anyway, folks, the link will be down below. Check them out. Uh, I, I, they're really stepping up their game with new stuff here. Um, the lanterns, the tools, everything. It's not just a flashlight company anymore, and I really, really like that. And um, I really got to say, their stuff is uh, its outperforming some of the stuff that I spent a lot of money on over the years. So, got to say, I like the stuff, and it's really, really neat. Anyway, folks, link's down below. Check it out. Underneath that is our Amazon affiliate store. Um, these, of course, are not in the Amazon affiliate store. They're at that link. Below that is our freeze-dried wholesaler link. Uh, we have a contest coming up with freeze-dried wholesalers as of... Um, I'm trying to figure out if I'm going to do it Friday or Saturday. And it's going to be a giveaway like you guys have never seen. Uh, so definitely, if you, if you like the idea of getting a ton of free freeze-dried food, subscribe to the channel and check it out when it comes up. It's coming up within this next week sometime. All right, so definitely check that out. Uh, we have our My Patriot Supply link. That's preparewithiridium.com. Two specials this month. Your four-week kit, $50 off, and your three-month kit, $150 off. Now, these kits are affordable to begin with, so adding that added benefit of having that money off at my site, which is preparewithiridium.com, definitely going to get you a good deal there. And below that is our Thrive Life freeze-dried food store. I have a Thrive video coming up. I have some new products from them, so definitely check out their site as well. If you're interested, you don't need to join anything. You can just order stuff as a regular customer. Anyway, folks, I thank you for watching. Stay safe and stay prepared.